This is the way of the future. This is what we signed up to do as teachers. You wonder why we didn't do this much sooner. The future of our country depends on it. It's very exciting that we're starting an energy high school here in Houston. I wish that something like that had been offered when I was in high school. These corporate partnerships are cutting edge. It is not traditional school. It's exciting. To think that we're going to have an energy institute right here in the energy capital of the world is really uh, long overdue. The Energy Institute is going to be a full magnet school. So anyone that wants to apply can apply. Most engineers are hired from outside the United States. I think it's time that we invest in our children and allow our children to take those roles. I'm going to be a mechanical engineer. A reservoir engineer. Either a civil engineer or a mechanical engineer. What's common across all of the engineering disciplines is it really teaches you how to think, how to look at a problem, analyze it, think of all the ways that it can be solved, and then pick the best solution. It pushes you to your limit. All the classes you take are advanced. And it's a very rigorous and challenging coursework, which is what I enjoy. It gets you geared toward college. We need a strong foundation in science, technology, engineering, and math because of the great job opportunities that we have and that we need to pursue. It used to be that kids had to imagine what their profession was going to be like. In this type of education, they immediately get to connect to the real world. They'll be exposed to earth sciences and environmental sciences and also offshore energy, and they'll really actually know what they're signing up for. Having a corporate partnership with IPAA, to me, has just changed the entire playing field. We think it's a great opportunity to have a partnership to basically explain to the students just the, oppor the opportunities that are out there. We participated in a, a IPAA externship. I got to see how professionals in the office place work. I met with different professionals in the oil and gas industry. It was empowering, it was um, inspiring just to go and meet them and talk to them and see like how they got to where they are. It's like made me feel that I could do it myself. And then after seeing that I said that's where I want to go. The real world experience that is, is extremely important because it makes what seem to be theory reality. The experiences that kids have been able to have has opened their eyes to things that they never thought possible. People who actually go exploring for like more drilling sites down in the deep ocean, I didn't know that was a thing. It gives them dreams and possibilities of what their life can be like in that field. One of the students said that at, at one of the externships they had a lab coat that they gave her probably to help identify her during that externship. And she said, you know, I asked them if I could keep that lab coat so I could put it in my room and be inspired to note that this is what I could do. Then by the time they get to college, these kids that have been in these academies have an edge over their college partners. I'm gonna go to UT, Texas A&M University in College Station. I'm currently enlisted to go to University of Houston, Petroleum Engineering at A&M. When they do go to college and then they're graduating, they can draw back from those experiences and, you know, communicate with these people that they had externships with and get further opportunities. I know I've stayed connected with uh, one of our students that, that graduated is now at UT and is a petroleum engineer and he uh, is excited about uh, internships with our company. So it builds and continues to grow when you have those kinds of connections. Having these actual uh, relationships with with people who are out there hiring these kids. What can be better than that? You know, what can be better than that?